Chairman. I guess I'm going to follow up on Representative Jaws reacts. I, I appreciate your testimony. I it sprung forth with a lot of questions like Representative, but I, get, um, I come from a county that doesn't have a metal detector normally at the courthouse, let alone at the district judge. And I think following up on his question about constables, um, if, if we would pass the bill that says you're not allowed to have a weapon in the district judge office, um, who would have jurisdiction in some of these cases to make the arrest? And I, I would just see a problem um, we already have, you know, he, he said to have the sheriff's deputies provide protection, but if there's no, you know, if it's a landlord tenant dispute and you have that, um, if you're in a, a police that doesn't have a police department, how would that actually be enforced? Do you have any recommendations state on police. that? Yeah, the state police would take jurisdiction of it. Then. Yeah. yeah. And so like, uh, that's where it would raise even more questions. I mean, we're, we're short some of the state police now we're, you know, um, so that was my question is jurisdictionally, if we don't have a sheriff there, and even if we do, if we have constables, if they have arrest powers. So, I mean, it sounds great to say, well, we're not allowed to bring a weapon in, but then we add another couple of layers that I think we need to have a global discussion on. Um, the other question that I had is based on that, do you have examples of where security is working well? Are they using just constables? Are they using sheriffs? I mean, it's, surely the state police don't have the personnel to provide security to most of these I think places. Allegheny County does, from what I understand. I, t I, I do a little bit of teaching with the constables throughout the state, and, and whenever I ask, taught some court security, Allegheny County seems to have taken where they use, they, they do use constables to wand everybody, or they have the, the, you know, the metal detectors that they walk into coming into a lot of their building facilities. That's coming from the, the ones that I taught there. Fayette County, I think, has made a, a lot of nice changes, and. We've had a lot of compliments that people feel a little more secure coming into our building when we do have hearings now that we have a constable or security at that front door who's, who's actually wanting people coming into the building. Now, is that coming out of county funds? I'm sorry? Is that come out of county funds? That does. Okay. All right. Thank you, Mr. Chairman.